What is sensor technology? As humans, we perceive the world through our senses. We see how we can grab an object like a hammer. We can smell a fire from far away. We can taste if fruit is ripe and ready to eat. We hear a car coming and feel when it's cold. These are our five senses, sight, hearing, touch, smell, and taste. As humans, we use a lot of products like cars, phones, and computers. These products have senses too, only we call them sensors. Sensors like temperature sensors, pressure sensors, and light sensors. That's how a product like an automatic door knows when you want to pass through it. But wouldn't it be great if these products could really know what we want to do? A phone that knows you're in a meeting and silences itself. A car that helps you look for a big enough parking spot. A computer that knows exactly what you want to do and helps you to do just that. To do this, products need a range of sensors and very clever designs. More and more, very cleverly designed products use a range of sensors to know what we want to do and become better products for it. Cars that see a pedestrian and brake automatically if you don't do it in time. Game consoles that know how you want to hit that ball in a virtual game of tennis. And health measuring devices that alarm a doctor when needed. But making these products know is something not a lot of people can do. A machine can measure lots of things with different kinds of sensors. But adding meaning is the real tricky bit. You need very smart people for this. That is why the Hansa Institute of Technology in Assen, the Netherlands, started a new study called Advanced Sensor Applications Bachelor Program. In this four-year study, you learn everything you need to learn to make products know what we want to do with them. Learn more at hit.hansa.nl.